Hi, Achana. Hello, Anisha. You look so pretty today. Thank you. And I hope you'll speak pretty well. Let me see. Ah, let's see. So we are back with another video of Verbal Vista from Tijus Academy. Welcome to IELTS Speaking Test. My name is Arjuna and I'll be the examiner for today's test. Okay. The whole test will be recorded. Okay? Okay. Yes. May I know your full name? My name is Anisha Kunyama Saji. How may I address you? You may address me by my first name, Anisha. That's good. Where do you come from? I come from Mavalikra, which is a small city in the district Alapura. All right. So now we'll talk about drinking water. Okay. Do you think we should drink a lot of water? Definitely, we should drink a lot of water as it is good for our health. It makes our body and skin hydrated. Okay. How often do you drink water? I usually try to drink uh, one to two liters of water as it's necessary to drink two to three liters of water a day. All right. Do you drink bottled water or water from machines? I prefer to drink water from machines because I believe uh, the water is pure as compared to the bottled water. Okay. So now a few questions will be based on robots. Are robots important? Definitely. Robots make a huge difference in this era. As of there are uh, in various fields, robots are used. Uh, for instance, factories make use of robots to produce high quality goods in quicker pace. Fine. Do robots affect people's lives? To an extent, uh, it affects people's life in both positive and negative manner. Robots can be used in various fields, as I mentioned before. However, it also affects uh, the pro proportion of the availability of job opportunities for the people. Okay. What kind of robots would you like to have? I would like to have a robot which makes my work easy, like helping me in my household chores. Fine. So that was the end of part one. Now we are starting part two of the test. This is your cue card. You will get one minute to prepare and make notes if you want. Anisha, you may speak now. I know the value of time and I'm a very punctual person. I prefer to reach the des destination before time. However, giving myself time, it couldn't help me and I have been late. For that, I would like to talk about a situation uh, when I was late for an important meeting. It happened a couple of months ago that I was supposed to attend a job interview for a position that I was really interested in. I left my house an hour early to reach the venue before time. However, things didn't go as planned and I ended up being late by 20 minutes. I was late because of a traffic jam. It was due to a sudden accident that caused major holdup. And I, spent, I stuck in the traffic for almost half an hour. After getting cleared it, I was already late. Initially, I felt extremely frust frustrated and disappointed by myself. As we all know that it's a job interview, being late have a negative impact on getting the job. After I arrived at the venue, I was relieved that the interview hadn't started yet. Quickly, I apologized to the HR manager and she was a kind person to understand my situation and even give me some time to prepare myself. I utilized that time and during the interview I performed my best and hoping that uh, I could memorize the lowest time. That was the end of part two. Okay. Now I'll ask you some follow-up questions based on the cue card. Are you ever late for anything? No, I'm a very punctual person. But due to some circumstances like unavoidable or unforeseen situations, I might be late. Mm -hmm. Why are people often late for appointments or meetings? I think it's because of the problem of time management as people are not conscious about being late as a wrong thing. 
Do you think people are born with time management skills? I think people acquire time management skills over time and through life experiences. Moreover, people acquire this skill with their guidance of parents and teachers. Fine. Thank you, Anisha. This is the end of our test. Thank you. If you look at the video, you'll understand. Warm up on angulum, cue card on angulum, follow up on angulum, none night to manage either tender. Now, if you have a doubt about the Q-card, you will complete it in 2 minutes. I have already told you, if we have a Q-card session in 2 minutes, if you have a Q-card session in 2 minutes, you will stop it. If you are sure that you will convey the ideas and the ideas that you will convey the ideas, then don't worry about that. But we will insist that we will talk more. When you look deep into the video, you may find some grammar mistakes. Past tense is a very interesting question. And also, if you are sure of a word, you will be able to speak a word in the word. Which means, if you don't have a word meaning, or if you don't have a pronunciation proper, that word will be able to speak a word. We will be able to speak a lot of words, but we will be able to speak a lot of mistakes. We will be able to speak a lot of mistakes. We will be able to speak a lot of words, and we will be able to speak a lot of words. We will be able to speak a lot of words. Pelajar kalau doubt ana, speaking improve ian ini je ianam. Karena itu terus tolong samsaer je tu mistakes beri nunda. The only thing is make use of every opportunity you're getting to speak in English. Ninggal kalau bikinna, ora opportunity ninggal use iya. No one will give us opportunity. We have to create ours.